Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the Dell XPS 13 9340. To open this machine, you have to undo six Torx head screws. Then, lift the bottom panel with a lever tool in the hinge zone, close to the top two corners. Don't fully pry the back yet because the central part of the vent on the rear is connected to the bottom plate. Press the chassis on the left or the right with a finger and pop the midsection of the metal plate. After that, pry the sides and the front with a thin plastic tool. The battery connector has a bracket on top of it that is secured to the base with a single Phillips head screw. Undo it, slide the bracket to the left, and lift it away from the chassis. Also, use gloves before doing this to avoid short circuits. The device has a 55 watt hour battery. To remove it, pull out the connector from the motherboard and undo the six Phillips head screws that fix the unit to the chassis. The capacity is enough for almost 17 hours of web browsing or around 20 hours of video playback. The result is great. To achieve that, you have to apply the Balanced preset in the Windows Power and Battery menu and select the Optimized Power Plan in the My Dell app. For storage, there is just a single M.2 slot for 2230 or 2280 Gen 4 SSDs. The pre-installed NVMe is protected by a metal plate that is fixed to the base with one Phillips head screw. Undo it and slide the cap to the left to remove it. There is a long thermal pad on the inside of the metal shield and another one below the SSD. Sadly, the memory is soldered. On the bright side, you get up to 64 gigabytes of LPDDR5X, 7467 MHz RAM in dual channel mode, which sounds plenty. The cooling looks fine for a laptop that lacks a dedicated GPU. It comprises two fans, one thick heat pipe, two heat sinks, and a heat spreader.